if you have a team of people that you lead and manage in sales, I think it's really important that you meet with your team and actually find out what their beliefs are around the Christmas New Year period. Because when I go and work in organizations and we conduct sales training and we talk about the peak times of the year where the trends are in terms of where the results come in, there's almost always a psychology around what the November, December, January period looks like and what kind of business we can expect. If someone's got preconceived ideas, particularly for those of you that have teams that actually do a lot of the outbound work or they do the nurturing and the sales process, it's really important to understand if their psychology is that the efforts that they're putting in right now are not gonna deliver them a result, then they're probably gonna take their foot off the accelerator in terms of some of those critical activities that they do day in and day out. And and this was something that came up with a, a client of ours the other day. We had an organization that goes into a fairly busy period uh, during this time. Uh, and the psychology of the sales team was, well, we don't really have to drive more work at the moment because it's already a busy time for us. When I gave the assignment to the sales manager to go in and find out from the team what they were actually thinking about this particular time, they were completely aghast at the fact that many of the people in their team were thinking about taking the foot off the accelerator, going a little bit more easy, doing a little bit less because it's a busy time of the year anyway. I'm sure the founders out there and the sales managers are just cringing, thinking, you know, oh my gosh, we've got an opportunity for growth and people are taking the foot off the accelerator. No! I think that these are important discussions to have with your team and repainting the psychology around the fact that this actually can be the most leveraged and lucrative time of the year if done right. It's a perfect time for a lot of people to actually have some of those strategic meetings and to map out what the calendar year is going to look like.